Alright, time to enter the water and continue our quest. Well, our quest isn't to go into the water, but it is to find Mew, that hot chick. No, no, not this one. I didn't mean her. She's still kinda cute for a spirit though, but since it's evil and trying to kill us, I'm gonna have to say no thanks. Oh. They still do damage. That's a good thing. The danger is when they're in the water. They can grab you from anywhere. Well, they also can fly, but in water they drag you down. And then you get wet. And when you get wet, you're even more vulnerable for ghost attacks. See how that's a bad thing? On the background a movie's playing, it's National Treasure. Yeah, it's not really a great movie. Good old Sean is in it, Sean Bean, so he's probably gonna die. I don't really remember the movie, but if he's in it, he's probably gonna die. He always does. I'll pop up in his game as a spirit. Oh. I often have something playing in the background. If it's a game that doesn't really need audio, I tend to listen to, you know, YouTube things or podcasts or something. But this game, I want to hear everything. Because the sound effects are pretty creepy. So the movie's on, but it's mute. Just something to glare at while I'm rendering or something. Or waiting for a loading screen. Oogie. This looks creepy as fuck. Do I want to check this? body in there. Oh, old paper. Time to read. The black water must not be allowed to overflow. The black water is the netherworld itself. Should the pure water ever be tainted by the black water, calamity shall surely occur. <laughs> yeah, no shit. The world of the living shall become the netherworld. The souls of men shall rot and those who would return to the water shall become the dead. The black water must not be allowed to overflow. It's too late, man. It's flowing everywhere. Yeah, it's a person. <sighs> Damn it. Is there another way out of here? Checking the map. We have to defeat a spirit or something before it can continue. Nobody's popping up. Oh! There she is. Frame it. Oh, that was easy. Am I allowed to touch her? Touch her? Touch, touch? I can't. Oh, shit! I know why. She was faking it! <sighs> Women. God damn it. I actually had a request today on YouTube for me to finish Devil's Third. You know, I started playing that a while back when the game just came out. And it was kind of fun because I live in Europe. And it was actually released earlier here than in the rest of the world. So I thought, oh, cool, you know, have the scoop. 
but it was such a shitty game that I actually stopped playing it. I mean, it's not totally horrible, but the controls just suck, and the story's like all 80, 80s movies cliches put together in one action-packed adventure. Some of the graphics are pretty cool. I mean, the cutscenes, they look pretty sweet, but overall the game is just ugh. So I actually just put it aside and I was like, nah, you know, I'll finish this maybe later. And I never actually picked it up again. Now I know I'm nearing the end of the game, but I felt like, yeah, well, whatever. Somebody asked me to do it, so I guess I'm gonna pop that one in. So I'll just finish the seven drop. Six drop? Seven drop? Where are we actually? Seven, I think. Sixth. Sixth. Yeah, sixth drop. Tch, me and counting, huh? Anyway, I'll finish this level. Ooh, picture time. And then I'll pop in Devil's Word. Just to play the last, I think, one or two levels. I'm right at the military base, so it shouldn't take long. I also want to finish this game, but... I'm doing that on purpose, you know, taking this game slow. When I have the night off, I just want to play a level of this. It's an awesome game to play at night. Uh oh. Damn, the door closed fast. Okay, let's open it up. An ornate black box. It looks slightly different. It's shut. Could Mew be inside? The camera's reacting to something. Hmm. Oh yeah, I see it. Can't get an angle on it. I see it glowing and I also see it on a gamepad, but I can't... Hmm. I can take its picture, but I can't focus it. Hmm. Yeah, this is not working. And we need to go to the other side. Oh, for fuck's sake. Work with me, man. Still not working. I can even focus in on it, but I can't turn the camera. Let's try it like this. Focus. Turn. Here we go. A skylight. Or something. Spikes? What are those? It is a skylight. Oh man, this picture is giving us the shaft. Okay, we need to get up there. This way then. And I'm checking a map and I think we can go around it. Probably means that another door is now unlocked that we couldn't pass before. Or we have to fight a spirit in order to open it. Which is often the case. Well, let's see. That would mean... Is it this way? I hate reading maps. Let's give me a navigation system. It tells me what to do. One meter, turn right. There we go. Let's see. We're over here. That's a dead end. There's a stairway over there. So I need to just back it up a little. 
Alright. Yeah, I know I can see the map on my gamepad, but I thought I would share it with you guys. So you know where I am. Open up. More water, that kinda sucks. The stairway goes down. You'd think I would need to find one that goes up. And I don't think this is gonna work. And the spirit will just lead us back to the black box, won't it? Yeah. That's not helpful. Is there another way? Perhaps I need to go down first before I can go back up again. Could be the case. The map is layered, but I can't you know, view the layers, so I can only see it when I'm actually on the floor. 3D map would be nice. Just scroll through it, but it's not the case. Then again, we're working with an old school camera, so technology might not be up to it. We're walking in circles. Oh, oh, oh. It doesn't feel good. There is a door behind here, but you can't get there. It's blocked. At least for now. We might have to go back here sometime. This game is all about backtracking. Turn off my phone. The tweets and Facebook things are just going non stop. It's kind of annoying. Well, it's not annoying, but I mean, the sound is kind of annoying for you guys. Hear that stupid whistle of my phone every few seconds? Mm, that's worthless. Alright, we're back here again. So it's gonna try. Oh! Well then, there is a stairway. To the next floor. Yay. Yeah, well, screw the spirit. It wants to go back again, but... If we're gonna check out this place... Come on, open the door. Now where do we need to go? Let's see. It should be... This way and then... I think we're onto something now. It's a garden. Sort of. It's not quite what I'm looking for, but... Hmm. I can go all the way around now. If this door will open. Door lock, it probably won't, but... We'll find out. And... It's a wall. Should have bought a rope and an entering hook. We just climb up. Damn it. Is there another way? We 
should have been there by now. Definitely. At least we're unlocking the entire map this way, so it's not all wasted time. It may seem that way, but... Okay. That's a creepy looking door. Nice. This must be the place. I mean, it looks important. And there are shinies. It's a good sign. Oh, shit. Oh, they're so easy to block. Every time I fall for it, it's just... the. Immortal flower. Those are to be pillars are placed to reliquaries filled with black water. The maiden lays with the black water. It's not death, but an eternal sleep. She shall not age, but stay as she was. An immortal flower. Creepy shit. Sleeping in the black water brings dreams of death endlessly repeating. When a maiden can stand no more, her body dissolves. And the role as pillar is ended. Only the strongest maidens become an immortal flower. Who would want to do that? If you had the eternal suffering, we become eternal. Such is our role in appeasing the shadow spring. Free film. Just one? Ah. Uh. Definitely need to use those more. The special films. But they're pretty expensive to. Shit. This looks like a boss battle. The spirit is definitely different than the others. And he has fire. What the hell's it on his face? Oh, for a minute there I thought it was like tentacles, like it was from the Pirates of the Caribbean or something. But no, it, it's a weird looking mask. Okay. Yeah, it's cool. Holy shit. Those little mini spirits are attacking us. Where'd he go? We see him floating, waving. Mm -hmm. oh. No time for singing, which I can't. He just make a noise, but he is killing us, which kind of sucks. Do we get him? First heal up, just to be on the safe side. Ah, oh, damn it, too late. I wanted to touch the dude, you know, get his memories and stuff like that, but I was too late. What's this? Some kind of hatch behind the altar. Maybe it's connected to the room below. Can't get it open, and the camera is reacting to the altar. Oh no. Another spirit picture. Another treasure hunt. Let's see. Focus. That's with the tombs. We've been there before. Ah, oh, that's not too hard. Wait, what? More? A lady on a boat? Have not seen that before. What the hell is that? A window?
Hmm. Alright, we have to find three places in order to open this hatch. So we'll do that next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Till then.